going on guys? Um, so I'm sure by now you guys have seen my Creek video. Um, so I'm going to take you a little more in-depth in of them. I'm going to look at the skills first. Um, we've got a plus five sickle mod, obviously. And uh, it gives great bonuses. So if my shield's gone and my mag is gone, we get 100% more, which it's not really gone all that often. So it's basically just 40%, which is still good. Feed the meat, 50% max health. Uh, light the fuse. This is more gimmicky than anything, and this is to help light the fuse. Then we got salt the wound. Now, this goes really, really well with the shield I have, and we'll get to that in a minute. But you get 20 stacks. That's like 120% or more melee damage, which is great. Um, melee damage, 450%. I normally use the throne buzz axe rather than the uh, close range melee skill. So my chance to attack myself is lower than 12%. Kind of sort of. Um, release the beast. This goes great with my shield and another and bloodlust. Um, because you get melee damage, awesome. Damage reduction, awesome. Now, where is it? Uh, that one. Um, if you get if you have a hundred stacks of bloodlust, you get fifty percent damage reduction. That's a hundred percent damage reduction if you release the beast and hundred stacks. So that's half damage, roughly, which is great. Uh, magazine size because filler skill. This is cool and this is cool as well. This goes hand in hand with this pretty much. Um. So at 100, 100 stacks, you're doing 180% more grenade damage if you kill somebody with melee for a short time. This is great. This is, I think, 25 seconds. Yeah, 25 seconds worth of Buzz Axe Rampage if you have 100 stacks, which is pretty easy to do. Um, especially if you're coming out of Release the Beast and Buzz Axe Rampage. This just helps them not decay as quick, which is great, and Blood Splosion. Now, here's here's the cool thing about Blood Splosion. If you kill an enemy with Blood Splosion and you're in Buzz Axe Rampage, you will get all your health back. Now, if you have 100 stacks of Bloodlust as well, um, you have 500% more damage added to Nova, which is awesome. I have killed ultimate badasses in one hit with the Nova because I killed their minion first. It did like 120 million or more damage, which is sweet. Um, so, gear. This gets stacks like no other, and so does the Stormfront. So if you're going into a heavily crowded area, you don't have a lot of stacks. Throw a Stormfront, you'll get stacks. Let them shoot you down to less than 33% of your health, then trigger release the beast. I also do not have fuel the rampage because of this. Because if you come out of release the beast, your action skill is automatically recharged. And if you go get down below 33%, you can go automatically back in, rinse and repeat. Simple, simple. Um, wild ass rockets. This is good for if there's no enemies around to shoot you and you need to get back into release the beast. Um, then shoot the ground. It'll damage you. It does a little amount of damage, so you can you, you won't really kill yourself with it unless you're reckless. Um, so use that. These are filler ones. Now, Rough Rider Shield. You get 100 Bloodless Stacks. You get Release the Beast, and you have this on. That's 120% damage reduction. That is insane amount of damage reduction. Plus 80,000 health, which is always good. So you've got 120% damage reduction and like 3,000 or 370,000 health roundabouts. Depending on your badass rank, you can take a lot of damage. <laughs> Except from heavy nomads, because they're bitches. Uh, Raid Sickle Class Mod, all the melee damage ever in the history of the world. And Might of the Seraphs for lots of melee damage. Now, 
here, I'm gonna I'm gonna skip this first part here. Cause I'm not too fond of it because of the buzzards there. And so we're just gonna drift down here, get into the action. But uh yeah. So first we will throw that, get some stacks going. And Sultan stacks. Release the beast. Heavy nomad. Take him out first. Uh, take myself out first, but, um, but some outlaw. Come back out. Kill that guy. See, where is he? I don't even know. Probably down. Juggernaut. There we go. 100 stacks. Bloodlust. See that? Ooh, critical. That's nasty. Shoot yourself. And go. See that? Blitz fusion. And we've got salt of one stacks. Which are always great. Kill this guy. We're rolling. anymore. I just work here, man. Ready? There we go. Let's take care of him. Critical. Nineteen and a hundred. See that? I'll just shoot myself. Back in. Right now we have a lot of melee damage, and we have a lot of damage resistance. More stacks. More stacks. More stacks. Who's this guy? Oh, we killed him. Oh no, we ran out of ammo. It's all right. We got reload speed for stacks. We'll just actually what we could do. Is just there we go. Perfect. So now we got a hundred stacks. Smack yourself. Hit the guy. Kill. Kill. We'll go kill Mortar, because killing Mortar is fun. And this is kind of the system I've come up with for this. Get out, get out, get out. I mean, I might not be like, you know, I might not have invented it, but it's the system I use. You see what I'm saying about the blood explosion? Go. So now I got 12 and 100. Now we'll go, go up. Your stacks are going to decay a little bit, and I'm pretty sure we're going to run out of bus axe rampage, which is fine, because then we'll just get up here, we'll throw a storm front, get some stacks back. 
go back into place to be such buzz X rampage. And we'll attempt to kill some buzzers. Oops. Miss. Missed like way completely. There we go. Come on. There we go. Juggernaut. Keep in mind this is with no slag. Ultimate wall hunter. It's really good. Really, really good. Come on, kill him. Come on, Creek. Yes. Don't be afraid to go to other targets either. Go, all the health back. Oh, we hit him, hit him. Oh, missed. Oh, well. Shoot yourself. We still got damage. We may not have duration, but we do have damage, which is great. Which is where the Dark Rider Shield comes in. It's basically keep taking damage, get more damage. I'm gonna let this run out because we got we got some stacks of salt in here, so we'll go down there. Actually, no, screw it. We'll go over here. And now we'll go. We'll go down there. We'll get out of here. We got stacks. Oh, that was good. I got a hundred stacks now. What would happen? I got buzzers. Such a bitch to hit. There we go. Well, we could go over there, but it's just gonna—it's gonna be the same story. Jump down here first. Should be. There we go. We got stacks. Never stop the killing. Never. 
Living on twenty here. Stop hitting yourself. Oh, that's not good. We need to find somebody here. I told you what would happen. Drop your gear, Ollie. I can feel the hurt. Time for a rampage. from the midget. Killed a buzzard with blood explosion once in the pool. Come on, hit him. There. That was Sawtree's Cauldron. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and it probably went on for way too long, but I really hope you guys enjoyed it, and it brings some insight as to a strategy you can kind of use as well. And I uh, hope you guys have a great day. Peace out.